Hi everybody, uh, the other day I went and got some Lego minifig packets uh, I think I got nine of them, they had an offer three for two so I just decided to splurge I was just going to buy a whole series of them online instead of risking my luck and getting doubles but like, it's no fun in that way but uh, also I got these the other day uh, I had to get this um, it looks so much like uh, the back pod which I absolutely love and I got this as a freebie uh, I love the chicken guy I never got him when he was a minifig and just showing those off quickly uh, I will do separate videos on those but first on to the minifigs uh, let's see what I get Alright, first package. Uh, let's see what's available first of all. I can't remember to be honest. So, it looks like you can get a farmer, a astronaut, a knight, uh, a bandaged person, uh, looks like someone who's had bad luck, a uh, Native American, uh, I don't know what that's supposed to be, maybe some sort of warrior god or something, uh, I don't know, an elf, a uh, Maybe a uh, ranger. Uh, I don't know what that is. Maybe a gardener. A ballon ballerina. Uh, just a space warrior. Looks like uh, some sort of ninja. Well, not ninja, but uh, in that sort of range. Japanese warrior. A shark, I'd love to shark. Uh, some sort of um, weightlifter, uh, a cat burglar, and a queen. I do have the king, so that will be good. The first one I get though is the what injured person, so that should be easy to build. This is me, really. <laughs> I really do like how they do the bandaged foot. Uh, head next. <laughs> yeah. I'm always injured. I suppose you could put the um, bandages any way you want, but I suppose it's supposed to go that way. It's nice how their t-shirts imprinted, so he's showing some arms. And he's got a um, banana, of course on the t-shirt because you're always slipping up on bananas so there's the first one very cool next up Um, we get the uh, space man space man 
This will go well with Benny. Just a one face. He's got a proper helmet this time. Bent they altered Benny's. That's upside down, you idiot. And the flag. If I can get it out. There's some brilliant detailing on him though. It does look like he's got a cassette on him. But on the arms and stuff it's just fantastic. And on the legs. Beautiful. I can change the visor over to a clear one. I do have a clear one. I think I would prefer that. See, Benny's isn't flat. They uh, put a bit of an angle on it. So the visor doesn't sit flat. It's just my imagination, but I'll put Benny behind him. Ah. I did also buy some more Lego Dimension packs today, so I can uh, open up some new worlds. I've got a Chima figure, um, the Wicked Witch. And another one that I can't remember. Uh, Unikitty. It was another three for two. I need to get the portal. Um, pack though. Level pack. Oh, these are absolutely awesome. These legs. Look at those. I love these. Oh, they're great. I'm getting all the ones I want. So, yeah, this is definitely a fawn. Beautiful headpiece. With the um, with the horns, I'm not too sure what he's. Oh, is it? A, it's a pipe, isn't it? Pan's pipe. I suppose he is Pan. Oh, these are great so far. This is definitely maybe one of the best rounds I've seen so far. And this one I'm not too sure what it's supposed to be. Uh, 
think it might be this it's next and you put the wings on the back These pieces go on first, I think. Don't know which way though. Yeah, that way. That's a bit strange because they don't really match up. There's only one way that these wings can go because of the way they're moulded. And his staff, quite a big staff. Maybe he should hold it with two hands. There we go. Okay. Oh, four so far, no doubles. But only just. No, I haven't uh, blitzed myself. So now we got the Arnold figure. Or maybe it's Sean Claude Van Damme with his hairstyle. I never thought I would see a mullet on a Lego figure. Oh, I'm totally doing that. <laughs> oh, I don't need to make more of these. I like the way in the belt as well. That's a nice touch. A crazy look in his face as well. These are great. the uh, Native American by the looks of it at least I don't have to put a skirt on her I hate those pieces that goes on quite well and 
and uh, I think you can either put on the baby on the back or on the front doesn't show you there but I think that's the idea nice hair piece and I've got it totally wrong there and this goes in here. Sorry, I'm off camera. There we go. So I think this can go either. That is so cute as well. <laughs> On the back, like so. Or in a hand. Let's try it in a hand. Mm. How does it work in a hand? I'm not too sure about that, I'll leave it on her back. So there we go. Oh, I think that's a pretty nice figure. Better from the back though. Okay, who's next? <sighs> so this seems to be the park ranger, female park ranger, although she could be playing lacrosse. You get a Gunk with her, Pepe Le Pew. and nice. Oh, she doesn't have a. She, oh, she's got two facial expressions. Maybe because she's got a skunk with her, it doesn't exactly help. Oh, I'm going to stick with the, uh, what's that smell face. This is a bit big, I've got to say. Maybe I can put the skunk in it. Yeah, that's just fell. Great. Ah. Come to daddy. So there we go. Yeah, no wonder she's not happy. I wouldn't be. Okay. I think there's just two more to go. I 
I really would like the cat burglar. Ah, uh, my first double. I can't complain though. And I did jinx it. It's a good double though because so I've got the mullet. If I had to have a double it would be this one. I still would like the uh, samurai and shark of course. So, the last one, I didn't feel around in the bags or anything, they were just put out, I think they were brand new, so I just picked up one after the other, and I got the fawn again. Oh well, I think seven out of nine's pretty good going, and the fawns are beautiful figure I love those legs I love everything about the fawn to be honest Okay, so just a quick look at all the figures. Just here's the fawn. I think it's a great one. I just love those legs, and the headpiece is just fantastic. Not in focus. I'm going to take the camera off, it'll be easier. Yeah, that's a beautiful figure. The Park Ranger's a bit of a weird one. At least it's got a double face though. And I think this is a lovely one. The baby on the back is just gorgeous. I'm not a massive Lego collector, but I don't think I've ever seen that before. And this one is just great. Just loving that mullet. This one, I, I don't know what exactly it's supposed to be. It's very DC Comics. Nice printing on the legs, on the sides. And this one, this may, be, I don't know, this may be my favourite. I just love the printing on this. Oh, the flag's upside down. Oh, that's gravity for you, I suppose. 
just put the camera down for a sec. Okay, so that's better. Now I just wanted to try it with the clear visor. But yeah, gotta love classic space figures. And lastly, but not least, is the injured guy. I love the detail on the foot, the way they did the printing. And I just noticed that he's got a whole load of um, signatures on the leg. I think that's great detail by Lego. Trying to get it to focus, focus, focus. But yeah, it's great detail there, and a fantastic face there. All the bruising, the black eye, and the bandages. And the banana, of course. So, yeah. That's another one that I really do like. So yeah, that was definitely worth, I think it was, came to what, it would have been £15. So, goodbye there, hope you enjoyed that, take care, bye.